Hi everyone, I hope everyone's doing well. Um, I apologize, this is, I should have put this up a bit ago. Um, I'm not sure what happened. I think when I was doing the last uh, batch of dreams, I got interrupted and I had to stop. And this one got overlooked and I meant to put it up and then I forgot and so I apologize. Um, I believe I had this dream about December 10th of 2016 and I recalled it a few days after it was very brief and so there there wasn't much to it but it was very bizarre and then a few days after I recalled it I started getting confirmations about it odd confirmations so my dream <clears throat> I was walking into a dimly lit almost like a ballroom and I was by myself I was approaching a large crowd they were all facing me but they had their heads down and they all moved at the same time when they lifted their heads up like they were going to look at me when they lifted their heads up every single one of them didn't have a pair of eyes they had blank black eye sockets every single one of them all moving in unison very bizarre and I thought Ugh, that's just ugh, creepy and it made me uncomfortable it made me feel like they had been taken over by something or that they were dead inside um, or both they were dead inside and something else took them over. Um, so, like I said, I had this dream, I thought about December um, 10th of 2016, and then a few days later I recalled it, and then a couple days later I was, um, I must have had, you know, a sick child at home or something, and, which is generally when we snuggle up and watch cartoons and, you know, hang in and the first thing that came on the television because I've told you before I really don't watch TV unless I'm hanging around with my family um, so the first thing that came on television was ironically Nightmare Before Christmas um, which is a movie we do own but it's just funny that it came on the TV and I was like oh that's just like the dream I had so as we continue to sit in front of the TV for a better portion of the day and watch kids stuff um, more things kept popping up and I definitely had probably five or six confirmations of this dream this was the first and this next thing was the most memorable and um, other than that I can't really recall all the little things that that I saw or happened that were confirmations for me but I just these are the two that stick out in my mind so the next one was um, my little one likes to watch this Transformers Prime, okay? And it's, I tried to get it up on Netflix so that you could see the name of the episode is called Deadlock, which didn't make any sense to me until I started making the video today. And I'm like, yeah, oh, that does make sense, okay. And I made it a point to have the boys rewind and tell me what episode, what season, what the name of it was so that I wrote it down so that when I remembered to make the video it would be there. So thank God I did that. Um, but you'll see it doesn't say what the name of it is here but if you go and look it up on Netflix or somewhere else you can see it. It's season 3 episode 13 and this far into it according to this person this this channel here um, his eyes he gets hit in the chest with this blast and his eyes are black now this is a robot and his eyes are black which just and I when I was watching and I was like are you really that's just insane so I thought I would make a video about it and um, post it up there because like I've said I feel like whatever happens coming down the road when 
people change, there's going to be no going back. Like they're just going to change. And that's what I feel like this dream was about. You are done. Deadlock. Like done. So, um, I don't know. Uh, uh, just pray about it. And, um, I hope that you're all well and blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you very much.